Oh wow, man, look at that precision fill. So the beer should be done fermenting. We're gonna we're gonna take a little sample and take a gravity reading, mm -hmm. and then we're gonna take some of your Solera project, mm -hmm. blend it with this. And Essentially, all we're gonna do is come up with a ratio. See if we can find a ratio that works. The magic ratio yeah. is what we're searching for today. So the steps are this: we're gonna pull samples from the Solera barrel and from our finished saison. Yep. We're going to take gravity readings of both. Th that will be necessary for carbonation purposes yeah and ABV purposes then we will start blending taste yeah do some ratios do some ratios see if we find something that wins right and then we'll probably finish this process out tomorrow mm -hmm. because we'll have to sit down and do some math on how much sugar to add we yeah. don't want to we don't want it to be under carbonated and we don't want to explode it's gonna be Woo! all right bucket of sanitizer Coming in, hot. Put some gloves on. I'm gonna try and be careful with this one because we're not gonna keg it today. We're gonna put the lid back on it. We'll definitely be purging this. Oh yeah, dude, look at this. Looks like brains. There's definitely some pellicle in here, man. Yeah. It's a time to get all the pockets. Dude, the legacy of the log can, lives on. It does. Oh wow, man, look at that precision fill. So let's pop this back on. We'll, we'll purge it. You want to purge her? Yeah. Yeah, when you're ready. Yep. Basically just trying to blow the oxygen out and replace it with CO2. All right, let's go We don't want it oxidizing well. Sitting here. So. Color is just. Love the color. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Can give this guy a little taste because it clearly had some weird stuff going on. Yeah, man. It's got that. That log smell. Mm -hmm. It's nice though. It's very nice. Like it's. It's super mellow. So the thing about the log beer was it had this like really citrusy, mm -hmm. had a really citrusy character and that's what's coming through on here. I'm not getting any Saison yeast really at all. Mm -mm. You can give it a little bit of gas. Yep. Sounds good. You ready? Yep. Um, actually, ooh, shit. <laughs> I guess that was that. The tap was, the tap <laughs> oh, was, was open for now, it's cleaning it. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Amounts. All right, cool. So next, gravity reading time. We'll uh, do the gravity of this guy here first. 10.04 um, with temperature correction, which is 0.02, because this is 74 degrees, it is 10.06. Okay. So this is 10.06. Perfect. You should write that down. I'm gonna rinse both of these guys. It off. A little higher Ooh, than I was interesting. Hoping. But I mean, it's 10 10 10 10. Yeah. Oh, with 10, with, so this is 10 02 with temp correction. 10, 10 12? No, 10 02. And this was 10 10. 10. You're right. So was it 10 12? 10? Yeah. Dude, good thing we're great at math. Yeah. 10 12? Correct. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So we got 10 06 and 10 12. But we have no idea what the starting gravity was on this guy, right? Um, so yeah, we, we will never know the true ABV of this beer. Nope. Okay, cool. So that is the first part of this process. Pull samples, take gravity readings. Now we're on to the fun part. Grams cool. sound good. Grams, Grams works for me. Okay. So we needed to add this until it's 244. Okay. Right? Sure. So we even it out. Living on the edge. That's what I do, man. I think we might be right on the money with one more of these guys. Ooh, nailed 44. it. 44. 
All right. Cool. So we'll give this a little swirly swirl. Yeah. So 122 grams of each. So it's a 50-50 ratio. Yeah, just 50-50 ratio, really. So we'll so get we'll these. kind of start there as a baseline. Yeah. All right. So 50-50, what's that taste like? What are you getting on the aroma? It's probably stone fruits? What's that? Whoops, not even drunk yet. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to act classy. <laughs> I don't know, man. It's still pretty astringent, like from the sour, yeah, super sour that's still. still coming through. Definitely still tastes the orange. Whew. Definitely still tastes the pomegranate. Definitely still really sour. And I still get a little bit of the chocolate. Yeah. From the chocolate rye that's in the Solera. I would almost do like half the sour blend almost. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like a quarter. Like a quarter. Yeah, a quarter sour, three yeah. quarters. Yep. All right, cool. This is 75% of the Saison okay. and 25 sour. Okay, perfect. That has like an apricot-y, apricot kind of taste to it. It gained so much mouthfeel. Like, it, it really helped out the body. Right. But yeah, the ap apricot. Apricot? Yeah, it has like an apricot kind of taste to it. You get that though? Yeah. Like, that's the first thing. Should we try a couple, couple others? Are you happy with with that ratio I could go with that because I think um, it's kind of lacking some punch right now mm -hmm. you know but with the um, with carved up you know like adding some carbonation yeah. will I think kind of give it that and it's possible if there's punch. any bread in there it might mm -hmm. drop this down a little bit too right yeah you through some of them sugars that are in there yeah man I do like that yeah 25% um, 25 75 75 I'm happy with that I think that'd be really nice. If you're into that. Yeah. Okay, we're actually gonna wrap this video up right here. In the next video, we'll show you how to bottle the beer. I did wanna remind everybody that today is the start and the end of our Cyber Monday sale, December 2nd, 2019. Codes will be the same as the Black Friday sale. Don't miss it, today only. Thanks for watching, see ya.